Hi everyone. For this question, given that vector A equals to i plus j plus 4k and vector B is i plus j minus 2k, vector C is negative 2i, negative 2j, negative k, where they are position vector for the point A, B, C. So indirectly here, they want to tell you that OA is vector A, which is I plus J plus 4K. So for the point B means the position vector for B, which is OB, equivalent to vector B equals to I plus J minus 2K. And the position vector for C means OC will be represented by this C, which is equals to negative 2i minus 2j minus k. For the first question, find the angles in the triangle. So we have point A, we have point B. At the same time, we have point C. So for these three points, they're forming a triangle. And we want to find out all the angles for this triangle means we need to find out what is our angle A, angle B, and angle C here. So to find angle in vector, we'll use the formula of cos theta equals to A dot B over magnitude A, magnitude B. So for this vector A and B represent by the vector beside this angle. So when we're having the angle data here, we need to know what is our vector beside this angle, vector A and vector B. So to find it, we need to find this dot product between these two vectors, divide by its magnitude of this vector A and magnitude of this vector B. So to find angle A, so the angle here, is our angle A, then you need to find out what is your vector enclosed by this angle. So this is the vector, the first vector, this is the second vector. So this will be our vector A, this is our vector B. So we need to find out what is our vector AB and AC, which is enclosed by this angle A. So to find vector AB, it will be AO plus OB. So AO here is 1, 1, 4. In opposite direction, OA, AO, it will be negative vector 1, 1, 4. Plus OB here, so it will be 1, 1, negative 2. Operate this vector together, we get 0, 0, then negative 6. So this is the vector writing in vector form, or we can write it as negative 6k. So once we already find the vector on this side, then we need to find the vector on the other side, which is the vector from point A to C. So vector AC can be formed by using position vector AO plus OC. So AO and OA, which is in opposite direction, you will have a negative vector. And then OC here will be negative 2, negative 2, and then negative 1. So simplify it, we'll get negative 3, negative 3, and negative 5. So here we have negative 3i, negative 3j, and negative 5k. So once we already find these two vectors, we can put it into our angle formula where we need to find cos angle A, which is these two vector dot and divide by its magnitude. So we need AB dot AC divide by its magnitude AB and magnitude AC. So to find magnitude AB, it will be square root of x square, y square, and z square. To find the magnitude of AC, same here, x square, y square, z square. So we have square root of 43. Then we're going to do our AB dot AC. 
so which is 0, 0, negative 6, dot with negative 3, negative 3, negative 5. How to perform our dot? It will be x times x, y times y, then z times z. So we get 30 here. So therefore, cos angle A equals to 30 over 6 times square root 43. So this angle A, we move the cos to the right hand side. Here we have 40.32. So after we finding our angle A, we will move to angle B. So for this angle B, we need to find two vectors beside this angle, which is facing up, which is BC and BA. So BA and AB, they are opposite direction. So BA will be in negative, opposite direction. So BA will be negative of the vector AB. So vector AB is 0, 0, 6. 0, 0, negative 6. So another vector we need to form out here will be vector BC. To form vector BC, we use position vector where BO plus OC. So negative position vector for BO, which is 1, 1, negative 2, plus OC, which is negative 2, negative 2, negative 1. So it gives us negative 3, negative 3, and 1. So to find the angle of B. So it will be differing here. It will be BA dot BC. So BA dot BC divided by magnitude BA and magnitude BC. So for BA dot with BC, it will give us 6. Meanwhile, for magnitude BC, it will be square root of x square. So referring here, y square and z square. So lastly, cos angle B will give us 6 over magnitude BA, which is already found. Magnitude BA and magnitude AB, they are same, which is 6. Then times square of 19. So angle B will be shift the cos to the right hand side. And then we find it using calculator. Then after that, after we obtaining angle A, angle B, to get angle C, we can use back the basic triangle properties where inside the triangle here, interior angle of a triangle will be having 180. So for angle C, we can use 180 minus angle A, 40.32. And minus angle B, 76.74. Then for the next questions, we'll be finding the Cartesian equation of the plane containing this ABC. So just imagine ABC is on our flat surface here. So to find the equation of the plane, we need the formula of R dot N equals to A dot N when we need to identify what is our normal vector and a position vector from either one point. So we have three points here, we can choose either one point. But for normal, we need to find out. So we want to find out a vector can come up from this plane, which is our normal vector. So normal vector can be obtained by AC cross AB, or we can choose BA cross BC, or we can choose CA cross CB. As long as we have one vector in these two directions, when we're doing vector A and vector B, we cross, we can get a vector perpendicular come up from the surface, which is our vector normal. So to do that, R dot N equals to A dot N. So N we can obtain by using vector AB cross AC or vector BA cross BC or vector CA cross CB. Meanwhile, for position vector A, we can choose the point A, which is OA, or we can choose the point B, which is OB, or we can choose the point C, which is OC. So we have three options here. We only find for one. 
So for normal vector, we choose AB cos AC. So put in into the determinant 3 by 3 with IJK. Substitute in our vector AB, which is found it before this, 0, 0, negative 6. And AC, which is negative 3, negative 3, and negative 5. Then we're going to do minor A11, minus minor A12, plus minor A13. So minor, we will eliminate first row, first column, leaving the element of 0, negative 6, negative 3, negative 5. Then we can copy and paste this negative 6 and negative 5. So 0, negative 3 to the back. So to obtain here minor, we can see vertically 0, negative 3. So to do this minor, we need the formula of AD minus BC. AD minus BC, AD minus BC. Then lastly, we put into the formula of equation of plane where R dot N equals to A dot N. So we will put our equation straight away to Cartesian equation as the question required here in Cartesian form. So in Cartesian form, R vector need to be substituted as X, Y, Z. Vector normal, negative 18, 18, and 0. So for position vector, we just pick a position vector A, which is 114, dot with the normal here, negative 18, 18, 0. So we we'll have negative 18x plus 18y, then equals to 0. Simplify this negative. As I simplify this equation, divide by negative 18, I will get x minus y equals to 0. So that's all for this question.